皆さんこんにちはりなです今日は名古屋駅に来てます名古屋駅に来たらインタビューをします外国人を捕まっていろいろ質問をします質問もたくさん用意しましたので皆さんは最後まで見てみてくださいねそれではやりましょう Could you start by telling me your names and where you're from? I'm Sue and I'm from Melbourne, Australia And I'm Steve and I'm also from Melbourne, Australia Okay, I assume you're married Yeah, yes, yes. yes. We are. Is it your first time in Japan? That's my first time. Second time. Second time. Okay.、Uh, how long have you already been here?、Uh, three weeks. Three weeks. Already、yes. three weeks. Already three weeks. How、yes. many、yes. weeks are you going to be here? Only one more day. No way! <laughs> oh no! Okay. Did you enjoy your time? Yeah, yeah, we loved it. It was lovely. Yeah. We really, really enjoyed it. So,、yeah. what have you seen? Well, so many things.、Um, so, we went to Tokyo first、mm-hmm. and then the Izu Peninsula. Okay. By car?、Um, or? Uh, yeah. yeah, by car. Okay, yes, yeah, yeah. Some friends、ah, took us nice. there. Ah, nice, that's great. We had friends just outside Tokyo. Very cool. We took us on a little holiday. And then we went to Kyoto for、uh-huh. a little while.、Um, and then we went to the Key Peninsula and we did the Kamano Kodo trek. Did you walk it? Yes. You have your backpacks yes, with you. Yeah, so, <laughs> how many days did you walk? Five days of walking. Yeah. yeah. Okay, it was wow. It Very, very hard. But yeah. It was really great. It was beautiful. Was it still hot? Uh, no, it was quite pleasant. Yeah, okay. Was very,、um, and then we've been、um, up in the Japanese Alps for the last week. So you're just traveling through Nagoya?、Uh, we, were, yes. uh, we spent a night in Nagoya four or five days ago. So you had a little bit of time in Nagoya as well.、Yeah. I love Nagoya, so I want people to <laughs> spend、uh, some time here. But obviously,、uh, all the places you've been to, they're very, very lovely.、Yeah. Why did you decide to come to Japan? My, I took my oldest son here、uh, okay. three years ago, just before COVID. Oh, yeah,、um, so you were lucky. Japan. Like, okay, yeah, we'll go、cool. to Japan. And having been there, it's like,、oh, okay, I need to bring my wife down. All the things you've done, is there something that stood out, something that was especially memorable?、Uh, I think the trek was probably the most memorable yeah. thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We went with a, a lovely group of people、mm-hmm. and challenging, but really lovely. And, and we stayed in these little, tiny little houses and guest houses. and the, The people where they were really lovely as well.、So、it's a spiritual pilgrimage as well,、mm-hmm. so that was, that was quite special too. So, yeah, but yeah, I love the country and the food. <laughs> we'll talk about the food in a second.、Yeah. Was it the same for you or something yeah, else? Yeah, pretty much. Okay, cool. Yeah, I like the physical challenge, the、uh, trek. So, you just like outdoor and hiking? I like and... challenging myself.、So. Okay, cool. Favorite food in Japan? What did you eat that was great? We ate everything. So, <laughs> <laughs> my favorite food was shabu shabu. Yeah, the okay, hot pot、yeah, mm-hmm. that you、um, cook, and that was, we had that quite a few times, and it was really lovely. We、yeah. had that yesterday, actually. Yeah, yeah. And <laughs> yeah. the sashimi, of course. In、yeah. the、uh, key mountains, well, the harbor、yeah. there is very famous for having great tuna. Did you try the tuna over there? Yes, we did. Yeah. yeah. Was it good? It was delicious. Yeah, really lovely. Yeah. Your favorite food? My favorite food? I'm going to go for、um, gin and tonics. <laughs> Definitely. Also famous for、yeah. having great gin.、So. But all the food's good, so. Okay. Did you have any culture shock or something that surprised you about Japan? I think it took me a little while to work out the onsens. Okay. Yeah,、so、there's a lot was, of rules in、yeah. yeah, figuring that out. But I think, you know, as we progressed, I got more used to them and yeah. So you enjoy the onsen? I did by the end, yeah.、Okay. And for you? Yeah, probably the same. The onsen is quite different to our own experience.、Um, so yeah, yeah, but it was lovely. Once you kind of got the hang of it, they were really lovely. So, yeah. So, you had a lot of onsen on the way during the treks、yes. to just re- refresh yourselves? We did, yes. Oh, that sounds great.、Yeah. I love onsen as well.、Yes. So nice. Did you have any kind of opinion about Japanese people maybe before coming here and then experiencing or interacting with Japanese people? Was there anything like different or was it the same as you expected? Or? Probably quite similar to what I expected. I knew that、um, because Steve had been here before, he said, yeah, all the Japanese people are lovely. And, I, and I'd heard that, and that was very much my experience. Of Japanese people were really hospitable and helpful and really friendly.、Um, have a lovely sense of humor. So, really? Yeah. <laughs> and really, like,、um, and so、um, accommodating and, and kind. I think that's what I'd say about Japanese people. So,、yeah. okay. Did you interact with anyone like, that you remember now, like someone you talk to or they talk to you? Well, I've got a friend who's been married to a Japanese guy. Okay, for cool. Over 30 years.、Mm-hmm. So, we actually had three, four, four nights with him. Did you, did you kind、one. of. Get to know that person? Yeah, we spent a couple of days driving with them. Okay. 
That's so I was in front of the, um, the van and the super's in the back, so I spent mm -hmm. a fair bit of time talking to Marco about work and everything. Okay. Did they tell you anything that surprised you? Not really. He <laughs> works really hard. Yeah. He works too hard. Yeah. Too hard. <laughs> All the Japanese people work too hard. All the city people seem to work too hard. Yes. But the country people, they know how to relax. People should just yeah. learn. Go to the onsen. <laughs> exactly. Did you pick up some Japanese on the way? Only a little bit. We Do you used, remember we anything? Used Google Translate a lot. Yes. Arigato gozaimasu. I've said that 20 times every day. <laughs> but that's very ugly. Okay, very yeah, good. Very nice. helpful. Yeah. Yeah. Did you learn really those before coming or while here picking them up? Once we got here. Okay, yeah. cool. Yeah. And, more, and listening to people helped as well. Mm -hmm. Are you the same? Anything you Don't want to add? Just terrible Japanese. <laughs> it's a difficult language, it yeah. really is. So, yeah. Yeah. I'm better at them. Um, like, I speak a little bit of Deutsch. I'm oh, a little bit of French, I'm German. So, <laughs> Japanese. <you know. laughs> okay. If it's just for the holidays, you know, knowing sumimasen and arigato gozaimasu, the Japanese people are already so happy and helpful with yeah, you. Very, very do that. So, did you experience an earthquake or any other natural catastrophe while you were here? No. no, no, no. Sometimes, you know, yeah. even if you're just here for a short time and you just experience something like that, can be very scary. Yeah. Was there anything you struggled with while being here? Anything that was difficult? No, I actually found traveling around Japan really quite straightforward. Yeah. It was. Yeah, yeah. Because it was super organized and everyone just follows the rules and does what they're supposed to do. I actually found it really easy. Yeah, really easy to get around. Yeah. Easier than Australia? I know, in some ways, yes. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Everything's really reliable. So. Yeah, that's true. Nothing yeah. is ever late, so yeah. that's great. Yeah. You were just coming out of there, you bought some tickets for the yeah. train yeah. as well. Yeah. Okay. So that worked out as well? Yeah. Okay, great. And then last question, uh, what, is there anything you would like to improve about Japan? If there is one thing that you could like make better? No, I think Not it's really. great. Yeah, we really enjoyed it. Yeah. Everything was perfect. That's, That's really good, good to hear. Yeah. Are you as well? I think I can pick up there. Okay, cool. Food's good, people were good, um, travel was easy. Was there some food you didn't like? Oh, the salty plums. Oh my goodness. <laughs> that was just too much. Yes. It's an acquired taste. I've the more that. you yes. eat them, the better they get. Yeah. I don't think I'm going to acquire that taste. But yeah. So for you as well? Yes. Yeah. Sour, Sour plums. plums. First time, <laughs> Thank you so much for your time. That was great. Thank you're you. Welcome. So, please tell me first your name and where you're from. Uh, Patrick from Germany. I'm Germany. also from Germany. Okay, so, okay. but we still stick to English, right? We will stick to English. Uh, um, is it your first time in Japan? Yes, the first time. Okay, cool. How long have you been here? For two weeks. Mm -hmm. uh, staying for another week. Okay, cool. Three weeks in total. Three weeks in total. What have you been up to so far? Dear so, a couple of days in Tokyo to start mm -hmm. with. Yeah. Then we went to Kyoto. Mm -hmm. uh, nice. That was a little bit our home base for a couple of day trips. We went to Osaka, we went to Kobe, we mm -hmm. went to Takayama, we went, to, we came here, we went uh, to Hiroshima. Oh, nice. And then uh, tomorrow morning we're going back to Tokyo for the last couple of days and then heading back to Germany. Okay, cool. What has been your favorite place or experience so and far? That is super, super hard uh, to tell. <laughs> I mean, uh, okay. being, being here for the first time, it's just overwhelming. I think the little things uh, are, 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 are special. Mm -hmm. I mean, uh, finding some uh, cute or uh, super awesome uh, food uh, store somewhere hidden yeah. in the corner. Uh, yesterday we had Okanimiyaki, so the, 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 the pancake. Yes. Yeah. Instead of having it at the street, we went up to the fourth floor. There, all of a the sudden there were three, four, five uh, places that served mm -hmm. that. So, that, yeah. so th those little things that you, yeah. did, that you don't really expect so that's oh, nice. I think the, the the best thing about it yes, I mean apart definitely. from being in cities such as Tokyo but I mean that is something you can also experience some somewhere else big cities well. but here it's it's a little bit different yeah. Yeah. yeah what was the reason why you decided to come to Japan uh, so my wife uh, went to Japan already in the past okay. and she, when she came back she said it was uh, the best trip she she has wow. ever done we decided together to go there again and that's why, why we came here what's your impression of Japanese people? It's uh, super friendly, uh, super uh, concerned about, I don't know whether this is a word in English or not, etiquette. Uh, so, so it's fun, fun to see what is allowed, what is not allowed, how many people rules. behave, yeah. many rules. I mean, being a German, I'm kind of used to it. <laughs> yeah, so that, that shouldn't, rules. that's not a problem, but uh, it's just funny. But uh, being polite, I think is the biggest thing that is that is outstanding. Yeah. I mean, uh, just, I don't know, the, the fact that they are always giving you money back with two hands and they're always <laughs> nodding. And even the fact, I mean, we went to Nara the other day to see the deers, uh, even the fact that deers can uh, bow. Yeah, so, they're so polite, so, so the polite as deers. Yeah, that, is, that is crazy, I mean, got it. They, they, it was taught from someone to them, so 
apparently that's from from Japanese people yes. and that just shows showcases pretty much how polite Japanese people are definitely yeah have you had any culture shocks here no, I'm not really I mean in the past I, I studied studied abroad for a couple of years and also met Japanese people okay back then so it was not really a culture shock because it, most of the things I could really the impression you had before coming to Japan was basically the same as now you've been here I mean I, I expected it to be big to be uh, colorful to to be uh, good to have good food but it's uh, it's more than that it, it's a little bit I mean the, the expectations we're here and we're a little bit beyond that <laughs> okay, yeah. that's so cool yeah have you struggled with anything I think the, the, the main point is always the language uh, so so getting around is, is it's not that easy but it I mean on the other hand I mean with arms and, and legs and, and gestures and all that stuff and then having people that are super polite and try to help you it's, it's super easy to also overcome this I mean, yeah. did you learn any Japanese uh, apart from the the basic words uh, <laughs> not really I mean it's also something that is a pity I mean being here should also I mean coming to Japan it should also be a, a, an exercise for, for yourself learning <laughs> a, picking up a little bit yeah. but that's something I didn't do so thanks but you for know, the remark <laughs> yeah yeah exactly yeah. that, that's what I meant with the with the basic yeah, words right I mean, but uh, having a little bit on on the table more than that that <laughs> would be cool but, I yeah. mean the basics uh, you're already you know making yourself very yeah. popular if you can say like two three words in Japanese exactly, exactly. if you could change anything or improve anything about Japan what would it be basically I'm taking back all the things that we can improve in Germany for example having the rails being on time oh, that would be I don't know it's hard to it, it's really hard to say I mean being here for the first time it's just I don't know seeing things that I have never seen before never experienced and then coming up with things that can be improved I mean how that, about the other way around you just said the trains yeah. you would like to take that back to trains, Germany what else uh, would you like to the polite the, the being being polite like that I mean in Germany you always you very often have the case that people are I don't know they they, 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 they feel attacked by questions or mm. get arrogant when they when when situations don't don't turn out as they are expected so and here every, everyone is just nice polite I mean one little thing that I experienced okay I mean just just popping up in my head was the other day when we asked about the train to uh, back to uh, Nagoya mm -hmm. and the, we already knew that there was no train going anymore that we could take so instead of just saying okay there's no train <laughs> they tried to find some kind of solution but there was none Okay. So, I mean, we could feel that the person already knew there was no solution for us. Yeah, so that's the Japanese way be, to do being it. Being a little bit more straightforward and telling us, okay, you don't have the free option anymore with the rail pass, you have to pay now, would help in situations like that. But I can yes. see, I mean, that's a trade-off between being polite and then being direct. Somewhere, maybe in some situations being somewhere in the middle. Yeah, I think that's a very nice example okay. that how Japanese people are like being overly polite when, yeah. you know, being straight would help yeah. a lot. Yeah. Thank you so much for your time. That was sure. awesome. Great. Cool. Thank you. Uh, please tell me your name and where you're from. My name is Enrique. Mm -hmm. I'm from Brazil. You're from Brazil. Okay, cool. Is it your first time in Japan? Yeah, it is. Okay. And how long are you here for? I think one week and a half. Already? Yeah, one already. And, a half. and, and in total it would be like 20 days. Okay. Cool. Uh, and you're backpacking around here? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Staying in hostels all over? Yeah, yeah. I'm trying to visit all the four main islands. Oh wow, okay. Yeah, yeah. In twenty wow. days. Yeah, yeah, that, okay. that's the thing. Okay. Have you already been to Hokkaido or any other island? Or? I, I've been to the to three already. Oh wow. <laughs> My next island will be Hokkaido, I hope. Because okay. okay. too far away. Yeah, with the train that takes a lot of time. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. Are you traveling with the JR Pass or are you yeah, taking yeah. local yeah. trains? No, I have, I have JR Pass. Okay, okay, okay that's great. Yeah, that's... Well, in that case, it's not that far, I guess. I don't know because, but well, at least I searched and I think there's no Shinkansen from Hakodate to Sapporo. Only um, local lines. Yeah, could be. Could be that it's just a local because line. I have felt any, yeah. so it would take a lot of time to get there. Take your time. <laughs> Where have you been before in the last one and a half weeks? Tokyo, uh, Kyoto, Osaka, Kuoke, mm -hmm. uh, Takamatsu, oh, wow. uh, Hiroshima. Okay, cool. 
How was Hiroshima? Amazing. Oh, cool. Yeah. And you also went to Shikoku Island already? Uh, which one is that? Because I, I, don't, I don't know the names. <laughs> yeah, the... sure. You have in the north, you have Hokkaido, then the big one where we are on right now, Honshu. that's Honshu. Honshu yeah. And then the other one uh, where you went uh, with Fukuoka, that's Kyushu. Yeah. And then there is the fourth island that's kind of like on the bottom. Yeah, yeah. I mean, uh, Do you have any favorite Japanese food? Wagyu. Wagyu, <laughs> Wagyu. Yeah. yeah. Because I'm from Brazil, we love beef and... Yeah, that's true. Yeah. Right. Do you think the beef here in Japan is better than in Brazil? Wagyu is really good. I think the, the, the meat itself is really good. But I think in Brazil, when we do, we cook, I mean, when we do barbecue, I think it, it tastes better because of that, the way we cook. Okay. But, but the beef mm -hmm. itself, or the meat itself, I think Wagyu is better. That's a very good answer. Very politically correct. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> see, see. <laughs> Why did you de decide to come to Japan? I guess I have... I always wanted to, to, to go to Japan, yeah, yeah, and now I finally made it. Uh, did you have kind of uh, expectations about Japan before coming here? And then coming here, was it different? Was it like you expected it to be? Oh, I guess I, I didn't have expectations. I, think I, I, I thought it would be cool and it, it's, it's, it's been cool. amazing. Yeah, yeah. Um, anything in particular that you thought was cool? Or the... I don't know the people or the culture or yeah the culture yeah I, I mean I've been walking and visiting places and every time every, everywhere I look there's something amazing like a, a building like also the people the way they dress the way they, 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 they behave is like it's great it's great mm -hmm. it's very different yeah, from Brazil so different. yeah yeah no that's that's cool I think so too so the small the little things yeah, the, yeah, exactly. the everyday kind of things. I'm always distracted you know I was <laughs> okay was there anything you struggled with while traveling here anything that's difficult I think that because I, I've been always distracted, so I, I missed a few trains because of that. I was busy in place and then I, I lost track of time. Then, then. Well, but there are lots of trains, so yeah, even that, if you miss yeah, one, you can take That's another, another one. great thing about Japan. So. Was, would there, is there anything you would like to change about Japan? Anything that was like... Oh, garbage cans everywhere. <laughs> that will help a lot. Yes. Yeah. I think Japan with garbage cans, like everywhere, will be perfect. <laughs> yeah, now you have to carry everything in your bag yeah, yeah, with yeah. you, right? Did you learn any Japanese? I learned some words, but I, or I, I don't remember them anymore. <laughs> it's like, yeah. oh, that's okay. Usually with you, English, you, you can right? teach me one. If um, one. Arigato. Yeah, th that one I know, but something different. I learned uh, Hawaii. Oh, that's it's a very good cute. one. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah that's a good I was one dressed as a school girl for Halloween. <laughs> Ooh, and I boy. heard that a lot. <laughs> Yeah, exactly. So if you can go and tell a Japanese girl that she's kawaii, they will okay. be happy. So, thank you so much for your time. That was great. Thank you. Koko de kono doga wa owari ni shimasu. ドイツ人から聞いた話で日本からドイツに持って帰りたいというシステムとかそういった点が聞けてとても良かったかと思いますちなみに皆さんが追加で質問があれば、コメントで書いていただければまた次のインタビューの動画で聞いておきますねはい